writing a good book too. Yeah. Uh, that that's too. Uh, your inspiration. I've been an avid reader for a long time. You know, it was a trip for a lifetime, and now we're hearing more about it. Two Kansas City teachers learning from the best and the brightest at NASA. How cool is this? Those teachers are now showing their students how to build rockets and how they can be the next astronauts in space. 41 Action News reporter Jordan Betts takes us to their very own space camp. So when we get to this point, you're going to take the tube and wrap it around the pencil. Students at Allen Village High School got a taste today of what it takes to work in NASA. Good job, guys. Right. Two teachers at the school recently traveled to Huntsville, Alabama to learn from scientists with the space agency. We um, became uh, a part of a team of people from 35 different countries, and we all worked together to accomplish different missions. The lessons learned in those missions now brought back to the classroom, things like launching an expedition to the Red Planet. So we're doing a, a semester long mission uh, where we're going to do our own um, a mission to Mars. So the students will be learning about resources, be learning about force acceleration. Another lesson focuses on math in space. It was a mission that NASA did where they sent a ship to the moon and it had to crash into a crater and then they were going to test the dust that came from that to uh, test for water. So we're kind of doing a little miniature version of that. Okay, keep working on that and call me over when you guys are ready to test it. The teachers want to show students that learning can be fun. We can learn and we can have fun at the same time. And I also want them to get that it's important to work as a team and that it's important to persevere and keep working hard. And that they can be the next ones to go into space. Because I feel like it's not something that's pushed too much, especially in the math classrooms. And it just kind of helps them realize that it is attainable and they could be the next generation going to Mars. In Kansas City, Jordan Betts, 41 Action News.